Right then, ladies and gentlemen, and whatever else you happen to be, uh, we are still playing Xeno Saga Episode 1, Der Wille zur Macht, believe it or not. And, well, I predict this will be a rather short video. Um, uh, now, uh, we have a few segment addresses to uh, pick up before the uh, final dungeon here. Um, well, you're talking unusually tough, Mr. Man. Hmm. Imagine that. Uh, right. Um, well, yeah, as I said, uh, segment addresses. There are uh, two uh, to find, specifically one here on the Elsa and the other back on Dock Colony. So we'll be hitting there soon as well. Uh, but. After that, um, uh, oh yeah, I just uh, read something. Uh, yeah, yeah, something the guide uh, that didn't really look quite um, as I expected. Well, uh, yeah, ramble, <laughs> ramble, ramble, ramble. Uh, it needed my attention. Is what I'm trying to say. And the uh, segment address we are looking for is on the catapult deck. Now I seem to be slightly lost here, to be <laughs> perfectly honest. Um, uh, I don't know the layout here, sort of by heart. It should be up here, right? And yeah, I mustn't neglect my Darjeeling tea. Um, let's see, I picked that up. Yeah, that's the treasure chest over there, the one in the back, the orange one. And we've turned that in for the uh, requisite ether. So the catapult deck that is this way, right? Oh, oh, so I could have just climbed down the ladder. Um, okay, well, what are you gonna do? Now we're here. So, after this, um, in picking up these items, I don't think there really is a whole lot to do before uh, the uh, final grind for, you know, money. Monies. <laughs> And all that. Uh, let's see, that's this one. Segment address number 14. And. Hmm. T. Black and black. Speed shoes. What do you do? And yeah, I took the uh, liberty of using a uh, um, biosphere, so sue me. Ah, I mean, using a bounce here before um, starting recording. Okay, increase speed 25%. Neo. Uh, let's see what skills we might be able to extract from it, though. Um, level 4. Increase speed 25%. If you have the accessory equipped as well, you get double the fun. So uh, that is definitely something you should keep in mind for Z, being the big old slouch that he is. Or uh, you could uh, give Chaos the um, yeah benefit or something, make him the beneficiary. Okay, so that's that taken care of. Now we go to the dock colony. Oh yeah, I can do cutting and <laughs> video editing. Um, now, um, I just discovered that I uh, kind of told you a slight lie there. Uh, after these two segment addresses, there are actually two mini bosses, uh, or uh, bonus bosses, really. Um, that well, well, okay, yeah, 
mini bosses that are not part of the uh, sort of main events. Um, and they will take some time, actually, so uh, the video might not be so short after all. Hey, I have my speakers turned off. And what do we have in here? Robot part body. Um, okay, now that the game will let me leave, um, let me just show you what this does to the segment file. So and circle. So, see that one segment address that we have neither neither the key nor the location for. Uh, that will come at a later date. And there's this one, number 17. We have the key, but we do not know where the door is. That is perfectly normal, actually. Note also the uh, robot indicator on the lower right. We have all the parts now. Um, so, uh, let's just go back to... Uh, yeah. To the Kukai Foundation. Uh, it's... Uh, it's going to... <laughs> yeah, I really don't like going there, but... Tough shit, right? There are, of course, also a number of things you can find there in the uh, Talk to Me shop. Uh, but um, I'll, I'm putting that off for now. Um, you know, delaying all the funny stuff. Okay is good. Outside is uh, slightly windy and cold and chilly and rainy and uh, overcast and unpleasant. So, yeah. Tea. Good stuff. <laughs> yeah, so I like my tea a bit too much. Whatever. Um, hmm. I'm actually kind of debating whether I should go talk about something completely different uh, from this uh, game, no? <laughs> or we're just uh, traveling. But I think I will make a separate video for that for uh, when I need to start grinding. So I can grind for money while talking about something very, very uh, interesting. Things, well, things that I find uh, somewhat interesting or um, worth saying something about. Um, of course, by the time you see this video, uh, you know, that video will have been long um, uploaded and forgotten, <laughs> probably. Um, so, here we are at the Robot Academy. So, are we going to finish the uh, the Kaiser now? Maybe, good sir, good crazy person. Oh God! Save face, why don't you? Uh, 
I am sure everything is very much not okay, but who gives a fuck anyway, right? Who cares about what I think? Right, and I noticed that the clutter is back. It was not there when Scott was here. That's typical. Actually, looks kind of cool or healthy, cooler than the others. Kelvin Dragon, or, um, Seraphim Dragon, um, ideally. No, uh, Cherubim. Yeah, that's right. Or Kelvena, maybe. Uh, yeah, I'm just trying to uh, link that to the mini boss in uh, Xeno Gears, um, but I am not doing so very well. Oh yeah, that's right. I got a lot of points for that last fight. I don't think she can uh, use her thing. Well. Yeah, her ethers are good and maxed. Uh, however, I would be remiss not to show you the. Uh, the, the, what? What? I can't. I don't have the Kelvin Dragon. What? I'm. Uh, I, I. I don't know what to think about this, but um, I don't think it's the end of the world just yet. Um, let's just. We'll just have to see. Still some 400 odd points away. Right. No more needs leveling up, of course. And points and stuff, I will bring her very soon. And yeah, I have set Xion up as such. Beam attacks will be something that we will need. That we will benefit from. This is strange. I thought it would be more. Or did I use those points already? Oh, I probably did. Ah. Okay. Um. Right, so let's just find out what's on this. Boom! Because explosions. Oh, you have more to say. How unfortunate. So you were thinking about him after all, Mr. Man. I am most disappointed in your dishonesty. Someone blew a fuse, and for once it wasn't me. Because anime. Oh yeah, that happened. Okay. Looks like you. We're not gonna get out of the Kaiser. Ah. Just, just kidding. <laughs> we are going to uh, go look for Scott and get the Erdekaiser. But there are a few side errands we can do when we are out and about, so let's just go and take care of that as well. Ok, 
Okay. And in here we have Stuffery. And some customers, most likely. Yeah, big difference. Okay, we can go here and grab stuff. Which is always a lot of fun, apparently. And, ooh, tech upgrade S. I wonder who we're gonna use that on. So, there is Assistant Scott. We will remember this and come back for him. We have a few more things that we should get first, though. Or, well, I say should, but can. Wow, it is really raining outside. And there's a dude. And go in here and destroy some more stuff. Skill upgrade A. I'm not quite sure what we did for you, but um, sure, whatever. Uh, let's see. Skill upgrade A. I'm going to use that on Momo. Tech upgrade. I'll probably end up using that on Cosmos, but we'll just see how things go. Um, I'll just, yeah, I'll decide that when I go grinding for monies and points and stuff because <laughs> I want that big ass mech. And I will need to collect something like 300,000 monies to be able to afford all the stuff I want for that mech as well, besides just buying the damn thing. And uh, yeah, that is going to take me a lot of time, obviously. It's also going to get a whole lot of experience points. Uh, let's see, laundromat. Okay, I'm supposed to be able to blow something up here. That's neat. Uh, this one. Yeah. Woo! Skill upgrade S. More for Momo. I was missing a word or two there, so <clears throat> I flushed it out. Flushed it out a bit. Flushed. Flushed. Um, sorry. <laughs> uh, I will f keep my flushing private from this point on. <laughs> okay. So if we go up here, we should, yeah, get an email. Hopefully it's worth the tro- oh, no, I'm- no, okay, just Soul Calibur 2 and some spam from Namco. <laughs> uh, I just- yeah. Okay, I, I mean, I, I do find it amusing, honestly, but it's just thinking about um, what the uh, discussions must have been like between uh, the developers and Namco. I mean, just... Oh, look at that, you can uh, do a uh, page up and page down. Ah, neat. Learn something every day. Um, yeah, I mean, it, to uh, add this stuff in, <laughs> like, uh, uh, right? Um, yeah. Okay. Now we're good. Now we can go over this way. And uh, talk to... Assistant Scott. Can I talk to you, perhaps, by the way? Yeah, it's not every day you're attacked by Gnosis. And it's not every day you survive an attack by Gnosis. Let's bring this um, 
little side episode to a close. Uh, I think you can only find these items, um, well, again, for like the uh, second or maybe a third time, I don't know, uh, before uh, you speak to uh, Scott here. So it's important that you do, that you pick them up at this point and uh, no later, because they might not be there. You have an inexplicable man crush. That's all. Probably makes sense if you're familiar with Japanese customs and culture, but um, I fear that I am not sufficiently acqu acquainted with the um, ways of Japan to uh, do anything but just scratch my head in utter confusion. Cosmics are cool, apparently. <laughs> um, yeah, okay, so I admit that I have some <laughs> slightly, slightly, extremely inexplicable <laughs> attraction to Max. Uh, I mean, I, I say attraction, but ah. if, the, if there's a Mac, I think everything is that much cooler for it. I played with Transformers when I was a kid, so yeah, and there you go. <laughs> Part of what uh, drew me to uh, Single Player Chronicles Cross is actually the uh, reappearance of uh, proper mechs, incidentally. So that drove me to buy the Wii U and the Single Player Chronicles, uh, the first one for the Wii. And oh my god, <laughs> so many chores. Okay, so, set. Now there will be stuff. What is this? The Kelvin Dragon is nowhere to be seen. I uh, I have no idea what's going on. Well, I mean, not not that, not that you really need it for anything. I mean, uh, this Editor Kaiser, you can see all enemies slash use once for battle. Uh, what it does is launch. An attack that uh, strikes for 9,999, aka insta kill. Um, I am going to go out of my way to not use it um, <laughs> on camera. 
Well, I'm sure other people will have posted animations of it, so I won't uh, go to the trouble of um, doing so myself. Um, uh, it's, it's just stupid. I wanted to see the Chubb and Dragon somewhere. Um, but, yeah, it also gobbles up Xion's entire ether menu. Uh, this is a bit of a strange way to um, handle your, uh, well, let's call it a spell book, honestly. Uh, mm, but it really it does um, encourage uh, tactical thinking. So that's nice, maybe. I don't know. Um, also, if you saw the previous fight, uh, you may have noticed that I did not use quick at all. So yeah, I don't, I don't fly that way. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry. Say some is just really one little instance, and then we can do some um, optional boss fights. I think I will cram this into this video. Uh, no, actually, mm -mm -mm. is there a yes, safe point somewhere though? I think there is one here in the hotel. Well, anyway, I'll just uh, figure things out and I will see you uh, in the EVS simulator on the uh, Encephalon. <laughs>